This new feature brings significant quality of life improvements for Vision users. It allows offline programs to target specific machines and it also provides migration to handle moving routines between different machine types. Firstly, let's look at how ring light migration gives a new offline experience. Before you open a routine in PCDMIS Offline, you can now go to the Edit Machine Interface Setup dialog and select the specific ring light required for routine creation. This allows a routine to be created targeting a specific machine, requiring less illumination changes when it is loaded onto the target machine for the first time. Once configured, the ring light controls in the user interface will match those of the target machine, making the creation process easier. In addition, using this same mechanism, an existing routine written with one ring light can now easily be migrated to a different ring light offline, without the need of loading on the actual machine. For routines that were created offline using the correct ring light configuration, you no longer need to edit every feature to configure the ring light settings, which is a big time saver. Minimal editing may still be required to account for variance in online lights. Now let's look at the machine migration experience. When a routine is opened on a machine which has a different ring light, PCDMIS informs the user that there is a difference and asks if the ring light settings should be migrated to match the new ring light. If the user selects no, then no migration will be performed and the routine will open as in previous versions. This means that the ring light will be off for all features and need editing to set the values. Now let's do that again and this time select yes to migrate. If the routine was created in 2019 R2 it will migrate seamlessly. Here if you check the features you will see that it's migrated settings over that best replicate the settings used on the original light. If you've run the routine on multiple machines, it will ask you which ring light to use to migrate from. So what happens if the routine is created in an older version of PCDMIS? In this situation, you will be asked to manually specify which type of ring light was used when the routine was created. Once this is specified, the migration will proceed to get the best ring light settings to use on the target machine. If you save the routine in 2019 R2 format, you won't need to migrate again. Keep in mind that routines now contain separate illumination settings for the different types of ring light it has been used with, and you can edit illumination settings for one ring light type without affecting the others. With PTDMIS 2019 R2, Moving routines to machines with different ring lights will seamlessly migrate the settings to choose which bulbs and intensities to use which best replicate the illumination settings of the original machine.